certainly know about trying to recover from injuries. Don, how's your, your sort of comeback going with the whole thing, the rehab? And yeah, going really well at the moment. Um, in, uh, in December last year, I had uh, surgery to repair my LCL ligament. My It's not bad, is it? It's good movement for a yeah. dunk pass. Bit of a test into the front corner. Yeah. Again, she's been wicked on that post. Good preparation, hold. Very good awareness. Well, it's four game balls, dunk pass, leading 10 6 here. Well, there you go. Impressive stuff. Jenny Dunk. Drop means that Lowe has four match balls. There you go. Nice to finish by Lowe Wern. Very solid performance. Impressive stuff from the Malaysian player. Hi. Um, yeah, so racket's pretty important in terms of how it can affect your performance on court. I personally think that as long as you're fairly decent level, you should be able to play with anything, but um, you're always gonna have your favorite type of racket and especially at professional level. Um, for me, I tend to prefer a racket that's lighter in the head. Uh, so not, I don't like a head heavy racket. Some players do, it's again, personal preference. Um, I prefer a bit, the racket with a lighter head, so it's a bit more flexible and manoeuvrable, a bit more, bit flickier. Uh, so for me, I like a light, lighter head or even balanced racket. Um, this one's not as uh, I'm just holding this one, but I prefer a, a thinner, thinner frame. I don't like frames that are too chunky. Um, I feel like if you've got a thin frame, it gets through the air quicker. You can get it off the wall easier you can be a bit more uh, flexible when you're close when the ball's bouncing close to the to the floor especially at the front um so i used to someone rackets i used to get a stanley knife and take off the bumper strip to make it as as thin as possible um so yeah it's pretty it's pretty important the racket and, and the dimensions that, and the weight and the balance that you tend to pick so for me yeah i like lighter in the head not a head heavy racket and a thin frame uh, string wise i probably go on the tighter side depending on what style of racket i'm playing playing with i don't like my strings spreading too much so you can see here this is quite tight I don't string my own rackets, I don't know how to string, uh, which is pretty cool, but I usually ask for around 27 kg, which is more on the tight side, so I just feel like it gives me a bit more accuracy, but again, lots of people like loose loose strings uh, for power sometimes, uh, but I prefer a tighter string, I think, so yeah, I hope that helps in your research, good luck.